What's going on guys? It's the boy Sam from Sammy CBD TV coming at you with another review, baby. Hey. Alright y'all. Now just clean this clean this glass right here, man. So we're gonna be smoking on that first. Yo, this thing would be badass if it had perks in the sides too. What? I'm actually waiting for my new glass to come in the mail. I bought one of the high club boxes. Decided to do a review on that. Uh, just an update guys, the uh, Jetson Bolt electric bike that I got, man, I love it, man. I take it out on the trails, and it's just so fun, man. I mean, it is, it's just such a fun, invest in one, it's $299. You can commute to wherever you need to go. The battery lasts a really long time. It's just very impressive. So, <clears throat> I haven't even checked out their Hawaiian Haze up. I did a review on it before, I think, but I just want to smell it. I'm not going to do a review on it today. This really smells good, man. Oh, wow. They got super fresh flower, guys. They, they really do. I mean, it's it feels fresh. It's almost kind of creepy how fresh it is. All right, let me, let me just turn this music down a little, because I feel like I'm really jamming right now, all right? So... I'm going to review the Pluto Hemp from Gas House CBD, okay? It's got the Kingston approves, seal of approval, but it is Gas House CBD. Merry Christmas. <laughs> Alright, y'all. So, <clears throat> um, I just wanted to uh, go back on a, on a topic real quick, guys, for y'all. Guys, the Tropical Breeze from Five Leaf Wellness, um, they were sold out of half ounces. I was able to talk them into putting a couple more up online, um, which I purchased another half ounce of it this morning. I love it. It's it's such a good flower. Um, you know, I, I really enjoy it. Uh, I'm, I'm even working on trying to get my, they're going to get me a coupon code for you guys. Um, so down below, I can put that link um, in my videos for you guys. Um I mean, they just, they're constantly putting out a lot of strains, man. And every time there's a new indoor strain from Five Leaf Wellness, I'm excited to see what it is. And that Tropical Breeze and Pineapple Dream and Sienna Haze, fire. I mean, it is, it is good. Uh, the Sienna Haze tastes amazing, guys. Almost every hit was delicious for me, so. But anyway, so let's get back into what we're talking about today, okay? Guys, Pluto Hemp. Okay, they also have a Pluto THC strain, I'm told, um, but this is their hemp strain. I did open this package because I wanted to check it out. Um, I didn't smoke any yet, though, so that's the cool part. So let's just get... Whew. As soon as you crack the seal, it's everywhere in the air. Everywhere. I mean, this is super gassy smelling right here. And guys, it looks amazing, guys. Wow, I mean, hold on. Look at this. Hold on. Let's see if we can get this. Actually, you know what? Let me. Here we go. Look at this. You see that purple in there? And you know what's crazy about this strain? Is that it actually comes with green buds too. It's like. <laughs> it comes with like little green green ones and then you got like ones that are purple and I mean this is probably one of the most purpley strains I've seen yet that's as far as like pretty I mean this is this is really pretty I mean just check it look at that see that shot that would be a screenshot that <laughs> look at that I mean guys that 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 really is I wish I could bring it closer and have a focus maybe I can Back it up, back it up, back it up, up. Look at that. I mean, I can't wait to smoke it. This, I would see myself buying an ounce of this. I would keep an ounce of this. This, this, this is gas. It smells like gas. In fact, it's funny the name's Gas House because of how gassy the strain really is. Alright, so I'm going to turn some music up, I'm going to start breaking up these nugs, and we'll smoke. So guys, 
Roll up, pack your balls, we're about to smoke. Even got nice little purple sugar leaves. I like this. Uh, this is an uncopyrighted song, but I'm really digging the vibes I get from this song. So, I'm just getting a real dank, sugary, gassy smell from this. I can't get over how crazy this stuff looks, guys. Super, guys, it's super sticky. I I would have to say that this is this is definitely a top shovel, uh, a top. I said top shovel. This is a top shelf strain. Let me just bring it close to you guys so you can maybe get a little bit of a. I'm holding my tripod. It's so weird. <laughs> Hold on, guys. Look. Look at that. I mean, that purple is crazy. Let me turn on some... I mean, I already have enough lighting, but... Let me bring my family closer to me. I want to feel close to you. <laughs> Anyways, guys, I just feel so happy today. I just wanted to thank you guys for being here for me, always supporting my channel. Um, my man Chuck, once again, I apologize for that one time we got in that little, um, I miss you bro, I don't know if he's still subscribed to my channel or not, but I, I miss Chuck, Chuck's a great dude, and I consider him a friend, um, I'm gonna shoot him an email and see what's good, um, <clears throat> Bill Stein, let me know if you got my shipment bro, like, you gotta tell me if you got it, like, it's, um, yeah, so, let's get right into it. This right here. Look at that. I love the CBD community, guys. Guys, just wait. Strains are going to get better and better and better. New genetics, alpine genetics, all that stuff. It's just going to get better and better and better. And the quality is going to get better and better and better. Um, I, I do want to just before before I hit this guys there's a lot of companies out there buying and reselling I mean a lot I mean you could tell by the hemp flower that they're getting it from some low class biomass cheap like dude if you're gonna buy from somewhere ask me first let me go check it out a little bit do a little bit of uh, investigating on it because I got some really good contacts in the hemp game and I'll let you know because yo my man ordered this shit right this guy sent him a picture of it yo this is fine Yo, he got it. It was just biomass junk. Like, the dude, he got a pound of it right now. You know what I mean? Yeah, it was 50 bucks or a pound, but, like, I wouldn't want to ever inhale that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, so if you ever have any questions, guys, feel free to ask me. I got you. All right? No, enough talking, Sam. Let's smoke. Cheers, guys. This is, I don't even want to smoke this. Bowl, this, this bowl looks so pretty. Oh, and a lot of you guys ask this. I got from a smoke shop. It was 90 bucks. It's my bumblebee pipe. I love it. It's perfect size. It's not too big. It's not too small. It's just right. So, cheers.
Do you guys ever hit your bowl? Look, did you guys ever hit your bowl and watch the oils go down? <sighs> I do want to let you guys know I am going to be investing in a Mighty Vaporizer. I just, I'm going to get one. I'm just going to do it. They look really cool and it looks, and you know what? I might <clears throat> start vaping a lot more. My neighbors are crazy. <coughs> so when I smoke this strain, I'm kind of getting like sort of the taste that I got from the Afghan hemp from Five Leaf Wellness, like that um, hash plant taste a little bit. Um, not super, super gassy like when you're smoking it, um, but I'm getting like a little bit of the hash uh, taste and, and stuff like that. Um, the smoke's a tad bit harsh. It's not super, super, super smooth and light. It's more like full smoke. Um, definitely really feel the effects um as far as like my body pain or like joints and stuff it just goes away uh almost almost immediately um but like you know stuff like that i mean that varies from strain to strain you know what i mean so traditionally usually that's what occurs um with most cbd flour when you're inhaling it um however um this strain specifically i can feel like this would be good for pain um, I'm not exactly sure 100% on the genetics because they're very vague on their website, guys. A lot of them, I mean, a lot of their stuff like dragon fruit, turp infused and stuff, there's not really much strain information on it, you know what I mean? So that kind of is a, is a negative for me from uh, Gas House. But um, <clears throat> the Pluto Hemp, I would have to say, um, it is a beautiful strain. This is probably one of the uh, prettier ones that I've actually had the chance to review <coughs> as far as looks. The purple is just, it's such a nice shade of purple too. It's like a light green shade of purple. It's strange to, to try to um, explain that um, very thoroughly, um, but it is super, super beautiful. I mean, get you an eighth of the Pluto hemp right now. I mean, go there, order it, because this is an experience that you don't want to miss. Um, that's kind of all I'm in for anymore is the experiences of trying the stuff and, and seeing, you know, how good it is. And that's kind of um, what I get with this is a really good vibe. Um, I'm getting a really good experience from this. And... I'm very glad I purchased it. Um, I will let you guys know that Gas House is, um, it's just purple. Gas House is, um, got like this purple, they got like a, it's a purple container, I forget what it's called. Oh, I think it's a Granddaddy Perp, uh, Turp Infused. I did not enjoy that at all. In fact, I'm most likely just going to give that away to somebody. Um, I'm not really digging that. Um, it's just not for me. Um, so yeah, but, uh, definitely won't be purchasing that again. Um, but, uh, in fact, I'm going to give it away, like I just said, so I didn't really enjoy it at all. Um, but this Pluto hemp is definitely a 10 out of 10 strain. It's terrific. The bud sides are small to medium-ish, so they're not super, super large buds. Um, if you were to buy, I don't even think they have the option to buy an ounce, to be honest. I think I only bought an eighth because that's all they had. Um, but I heard a lot of good things about the Pluto hemp um, as far as their even their Pluto THE strain. So that's what kind of intrigued me to try it. So yeah, um, moving forward, I have discovered a website that has all hydro hydroponic indoor strains. Um, so I'm going to check them out. Um, I actually shot them an email um, to reach out to them to do some reviews on some of their products. Um, I'm going to, and it's going to sound funny guys, but I got this jellyfish light that's coming in the mail. It was like 70 bucks. I'm going to do a review on that. We're going to do smoke sesh, review the light. I'll be putting it together and everything. You guys can see the final product. I just got like the vibe would be super chill to put next to my bed to like look at, help you fall asleep and stuff. Um, so that's why I bought it. I know it's an impulse buy guys, right? You got that? 
Government money, everybody wants to do the impulse buy. So, jellyfish lamp it was, alright. That's what I decided to buy. That's kind of a harsh, a harsh smoke. I don't really enjoy the smoke, though. Because of how harsh it is. <coughs> but, um... Yeah, I don't know, guys. I, uh... I don't know. So, hey, thanks for tuning in, guys. I think we're gonna just end this one in a minute. I really appreciate everybody for tuning in always to my videos, guys. I'm, I'm almost at 400 subscribers, and I never thought I'd be there. Um, I Actually, I did think I'd be there, but I thought I'd be there faster. Um, but... As I pick up new subscribers, I just, I love it. You know, I love it. I really just like, I like the conversations, honestly. I don't really give a shit about anything else other than the conversations I can have with people. My man Luke, we do videos. Uh, Chris, we do video calls. Uh, Capo, we do video calls. You know, I, I got a lot of good people, man. Good friends. I'm meeting good people. Good folks. All the way from Chicago, down to North Carolina, to Alabama. <clears throat> so, I'm in Pennsylvania, so... But, uh, yeah, so, that's all I got to review on this train, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Like, comment, subscribe, click the bell, subscribe. Um, means a lot to me, so, thanks, guys.